The West Bank is far from being renowned worldwide as an international art hub. Ramallah, which is known as a haven for the West Bank's cultural life, has only one or two art galleries and no city art museum. But outside traditional museum exhibit halls, walls are serving as the canvas for a burgeoning street art culture. There are different forms of street and public art in the West Bank. Some has an obviously spontaneous and improvised feel, like the work of graffiti artists stenciling or scribbling on walls. In other places, murals completed by Palestinian and sometimes international artists cover entire walls. Some members of the West Bank art scene see there has been an increase in street art in the West Bank in the last few years, linked to the revolutions going on in the Arab world and the clever and vibrant visual culture which plays such a large part in them. Yet street art and graffiti has a history in the West Bank. There's uh, a historical background to street art um, or, um, and, and graffiti, for example, like if it's how it started with the first intifada and the political role uh, that it played, uh, what is the role that it plays now, um, and we have to, to, to look at it in context, uh, uh, I think. Political conditions play a definite role in street art and always have. Much of street art focuses on criticizing Israeli military control of the West Bank and the repercussions it has on Palestinians' lives. One of the biggest street art exhibits is the separation wall between Israel and the West Bank. The wall has become colorfully decorated with creative and striking pieces which criticize its presence as a canvas. But while traditional political themes persist, young artists are also interested in turning their lenses towards Palestinian society. The most important thing we, we do actually in painting for myself actually is the, about the human rights, uh, especially the women rights in our society as a Palestinian. And uh, well, uh, for me, uh, I had many uh, experiments with others that how I can express the idea of uh, how we can define the uh, women rights in Palestine. One of the important and newer developments in art and street art is recognition and support of its social role. The Ramallah municipality really, with its cultural department, uh, encourages public art, uh, if you wish. Uh, we believe that although there are many cultural centers operating in the city, uh, the service, our art and culture as a commodity, remains to be elitist mm -hmm. and is accessible not to the entire population. So we're very keen at facilitating the interventions or public interventions in art. Uh, there are different forms of public art. Uh, drawings are one, but we tend to support support or we organize events that engage the community, where the community is an active participant, not only a recipient of art. The West Bank and Ramallah art scene does not possess the glamour and worldliness typical of many major art hubs. But artists in the West Bank are engaging with questions about what makes good art and what role art plays in society that makes street art in the West Bank full of energy and edge. Winnie Mancini, JN1, Ramallah.